Welcome to Rogue Tech, a mod overhaul on the Battletech engine. Command interface initiated. Welcome back to Dexter's Wolf Pack. We're dropping in in Rogue Tech. I got my two tons of mech, and I'm going on a 1.5 skull mission. So I'm I'm increasing my difficulty uh, half a skull every time I go in here. Uh, what we got going on is we're supposed to go in and take out this uh, enemy lance that's been uh, terrorizing the neighborhood, if you will. I'm not sure what that looks like. I've done a little bit of tweaking. Uh, we've added a narc beacon on the dragon. Um, I took out the long range missiles and put in the short range missiles. He's really intended to get in there and fight, so I changed that around a little bit. Um, there is on Jester no change. I think actually as well, the AC5 has been altered to precision ammo. So instead of doing 45, it's doing 40 points of damage, but I got a bonus to hit. Um, I thought that was kind of important given how many times, you know, we're missing stuff. Um, and then uh, the rest of it's pretty much the same. So uh, let's get going in here. Um, first, I think I will... How close are you? Kind of close. How do I want to do this? Looking at my terrain. Holy smokes, really? Uh, that means I must have some, like, reinforcements in here somewhere. That goes right up the wall. So that means the reinforcements are either going to come down that alley or down this alley. Let's go over this away. Uh, do I, want, I don't want to run. I have no need to run. I'm going to go up into the forest. So that way if I want to, I can shoot and still get forced cover. I'm getting a sensor trace. Wow, these guys are like right on my butt. Okay, we'll stop there. Uh, you can come up. Nope. You know what? Let's get the full evasion. Position confirmed. I did walk, didn't I? Did I sprint? I must have sprinted. There's a move this way. Actually, let's get right up in here. And you're gonna move as well, right up in here. There we go. We got a little. Everybody's got forest cover. I like it. Embrace. So one guy embrace, but he's still got forest cover of 75%. Alright, so I'm going to probably... Well, hello. Reserve. Come on. Come to daddy. That's a little bit of a weak move. Talk to me. Really? Really? Alright. Um, hey, you. Your job is to get up here and take a peek at people. Can you get anything? You can't get anything, really? Damn it. Let's come up here then. Kind of close in a little bit. That should still give me uh, some protection. The hiding. You got something else moving back there I haven't seen yet? It looks like it. I didn't hear anything, so it must not be a tank. Um, I can move to here, get the forest cover again, and brace. Good to go. All right, and my hunchback. Forest cover here. No problem. On my way. Beautiful. Brace. And Got last, oh, he's got the plasma, he's got the haywire. He's supposed to move pretty good. Got jump jets too. Do I want to come over here like this? I think that's, good. yeah, that's still going to give me a pretty good hiding spot. A little bit of a hidey hole on the side here, but I'll brace anyway just in case. But that way the, uh, the, the two heavies take the damage. Okay, guys, come in. Come on, peek yourself in there. He delayed. Me too. Oh, he's backing up? You're baiting me in. Waiting for the shot. Alrighty okay. then. Can I move to a point where I can... S yes, I can. And do I get forest? I do. How nice. Roger that. We've got company. So we do. There's one back there. 
Nowhere else, huh? That's my chances to hit. Blah. Narc Beacon wouldn't be bad. I got a lot of ammo. So let's see. I got 12 rounds of this stuff. So there's no reason not to have him with everything I got. Did the narc hit him by chance? It would be nice if it did. Fatigued, huh? I don't know if the narc hit. I don't think it did. Nope, it hit. Nice. Ready to get it on. So I think I do have a range shot here. Just a gauss. It is the trench. So what I could do Order. is now nah, I don't want to move you. You've got haywire. Let's just look like. Can I get a hit from here on you with the haywire? No. It's that blackjack. Can't get haywire there. So I think if I go here, full evasion in the woods for additional defense, plasma cannon on the dude. Engaging. Missed, but oh no, he come on, that was so close. All right, now he's gonna move it. Excellent, coming up close. A hit or two in the dragon, actually, more than just a hit or two in the dragon. Waiting for orders. All right, now it's my turn. Actually, if I go here, yeah, there's partial. To so the guy in the back. That way he can't get a clean shot on me. And, and interrupted uh, lines of sight are actually quite valuable. So now I've got bonuses. Let's take a look at this. So weapon accuracy, move, target. It doesn't show the bonus to hit. Shot modifier, plus four. It doesn't show the bonus to hit from uh, the, the narc that's on him. Affirmative. Ooh, nice shot. How are you feeling about that? You you, you, just, you just took it like a champ, huh? All right. Yes, Commander. All right, I want you to move a bunch. But I also want you to stay like this. Here we go. Max evasion. How many points you got? Four, huh? Two medium lasers on you. There's some 24 points. Nice. Trench is probably one of the heavier things they've got. One would a hope. Trench is moving. Fast little dude. Wow. That's some decent hits. What's up, boss? Um, he could not get in there to get that, but, so I'm going to wait a moment. Uh, you can get to, I don't need to increase the chances of getting shot at. Hey. Oh, not a bad shot with the Haywire Protocol. We'll do that. Greetings. Hey, the haywire hit him. Sweet. It's critical. Waiting You're heating up, buddy. I am going to wait with you. Waiting for my opening. Blackjack's coming forward. Nice. Missing the hunchback. Reporting. Minimal damage. I guess he had a tag. Talk to me. Um. What's up, boss? You. I think I move you right to here. Yeah. Look at those shot chances. Actually, though, wait. The narc is probably a better thing to get going here. So if I go to here. Nice.
Hello. All weapons are go. I should have. I think I painted him again, which is all good by me. Gonna pop in? You are hunchback from way back in range. Ready Nothing. Excellent. All right. So now I'm gonna come here. Yeah. Look at those numbers. Look at those hit numbers. Yep. You, sir. Sweet! You didn't go over, huh? Alright. So now it's my turn to move up to like here. Medium lasers, flamers, all the good stuff. Go. Does that shoot him down? I got a knockdown. I had a 39 heat. I don't know if that's enough. It might be. He's stressed out. He's heat critical. Any heat at all cause him shut down. All right. My turn. Ready for orders. Guess what? Do I get out of here? Do I bail or do I finish the job? If I go here, I get two. Two blips. And I feel that's worthwhile. Because I'm going to shut his butt down. Leg down. Wow. This guy is like... He's got guts. You're not going to punch yet? You should punch. Punch out, buddy. Punch out. Nope. Still not punching out. Shut down. No ammo, apparently. Because nothing's cooking off. Yes, Commander. Popo, my boy. Come on up. Um, I don't know if we can add any more heat to this, but you know what? We're going to keep hammering on the one dude until he goes. Chest. Woohoo! Nice. Dead trench. Your turn. Is this a... No, this is a three lance mech. So you hit the dragon, huh? How can I help? Do I stand? No, I don't stand. I have to move. Like this. Copy that. Still got good armor. My heat's getting up there. I'm probably going to have to pause this next round. How about this round? Really? Do I see the SRMs? Nah. Okay. I got a number of hits with the SRMs. That's good. Not to mention the fact that I narked him. Whoa! Dude! How many weapons do you have on that thing? Not cool. What? Okay. <laughs> That's dangerous. Um. Yeah. All right. Let's move. I think I'm moving so I can get into like combat range here. This is good shots. Those are really good shots, except for my gauss. Could do it anyway. Location confirmed. Take out the AC tens. Maybe. I'll push them down around too if I do a precision shot. No. Nice. There's an arm. Recovered to normal. Dude, you didn't get stressed by that. I'm impressed. All right, I took a bit of damage, but that being said, nah, where am I going to go? How about, um, who's got all over the screen? Damn it. Really? I'm just a little thing. Some heat. He's about to go over. 
think Popo, you're gonna go first. Good to go. Let's move you way over here. Nope. No. Ah, oh, gotta back out. But so I have a partial shot on this guy now. Copy that. Still, pretty decent chance to hit him, but I missed. My own damn fault. Oh, neat. <laughs> the MP Haywire knocked him over. Nice. Panic check. Stability check failed. So now he's down in two, so he's going to be fish food. So I think... Why, why is that? Just one click on my mouse wheel is like doing bizarre stuff. Can I go over here maybe? Hit him? Let's do that. Structure exposed. Nice. Fatigued. Cook him up. I don't know how much. Whoa! Nice. Left arm. That took out a bunch. Knocked him down too. Wow. That is awesome. That is absolutely awesome. Um. Talk to me. Oh God! What am I gonna do now? Who? Who gets who gets who gets deaded first? That's one AC ten out. One medium laser out, really? That's it. What do you got in the center? Forty five. Maybe I do go in and like whack the crap out of this dude. Let's go over here and face this way. I feel like the hunchback is the worst threat. Blackjack can hit pretty hard, too. I could probably kill the Blackjack. No, it's 135. I think it's much, much more effective just to go here. I'm going to overheat on this. Roger. Excellent. All right, Jester. Yes, you can go in and kick him. But you can also go over right here. What's the chance to hit? Wow. Let's do that. Like I said, this dude is a little bit more threatening to me. Seven medium lasers still. And what do we got left in the center? 196. Still got a chance at it. Fire. Nice. Hostile removed. All right. I don't think this guy is going to do critical damage to anything in one round. It can hurt. Then he's probably going to melee. Being flanked. No. Rear shot. Okay. Probably not a bad call. Commander. Hey, you. And it doesn't seem like the flamers add heat as a melee attack. <laughs> nice. A little bit more damage, stability check, 52 heat, maxed out. Not maxed out, but yeah. Incapacitated. Nice. Nice. So that was a 1.5 mission. Successful. And that wasn't too bad. I felt like I had control throughout. Um, I netted 320,000. I got a little bit of Lear in Commonwealth, a little bit of Torian Concordian down, and uh, increasing the review board. Nice. And the uh, the XP actually is less than, uh, you know, across the board than before. All right, so now I have some chance. Here's some, some blackjacks at 55 tons. That, that is very tempting. Let's take a look and see what else we have laying around here. It's UAC 10, 55 damage times 2. 
heavy auto cannon. The ultra auto cannons retain most of their smaller cousin's profile while effectively doubling their rate of fire. The UAC-10 is your basic heavy gun, good damage, range, and heat efficiency. Wow. 55 doubled. That's not bad at all. What else? Supercharger, we're familiar targeting, computer. Accuracy and improved cold shot. Charge stuff are used to prevent normal weapon drift from factors such as recoil and movement while the computer accounts for atmospheric and other conditions to present an accurate lead on the target. This allows for far more surgical precision of weapons fire, especially with naturally accurate systems. And ultralight gyro. gyro. Supercharger, huh? All right, what else? Nothing? I like, what, what, is there a way here? No. So I think I'm taking the targeting computer. Um, I'm tempted to take the UAC, actually. But I need to start working towards some heavier mechs. But I'm sure I'm going to pick up a number of pieces there, actually. Let's do it that way. We're going to assume that we're going to pick up some extra pieces. We're going to take the UAC. And confirm. I got a piece of hunchback. Not what I thought I was going to get, but fine. Some heat sinks. Oh, look, I got a double heat sink. That's good. I like, I like the feel of the looting a little bit more. Um, I am, I am truly looking to do long-term investments. You know, it feels complete. that way. Top not to work, if I may say so. Of course you can. I expect nothing less. All right, let's go off to the ship upgrades first. So I've got the repair and refit going. What are my options here? 450, but I need conduits. I need conduits. So I need conduits. Let's do the conduits. It'll take a bit, but we'll get it done. All right, so then we're in the barracks. Let's take a look at the mech warriors. So I was thinking of going up this route. I still don't have enough points to spend anywhere. No. Okay, here's some, I think. Kinda. Uh, bulwark would be good for you, and I, I don't remember if I put you in the the commander, the, the com commando, but I, I should be putting you in the command, uh, commando. But I think what I want to do, what is this? An unsteady threshold... And what base melee hit? <sighs> yeah, yeah, actually, let's do that. Because I'm doing a lot of melee. Mech warrior training complete. Very good. Popo, you really don't quite have it there, do you? Though I think a bonus to hit wouldn't be bad. Let's do that. Training. Getting everybody up to fours before I really go anywhere else. And you. Let's get your gunnery up too. Confirm. Good. All right, now in the mech bay, I picked up some stuff. I may want to wait or not wait. Um, you're, you're, you're decked out already. The dragon's picking up stuff. Oh, I put the extra move on you, didn't I? I put the tactics on you. I like the way the narc beacon look, worked. The precision ammo is working good for me. I picked up the UAC. What I'm thinking about is whether or not I should replace like a, the, the plasma cannon with the UAC. It has a higher punch rate. Let's take a look at the hunchback. It's got a standard uh, heat sink in it, so yeah, double heat sink here is probably worthwhile. So I'm going to pull out one heat sink and put in a double. Um, I don't know if I'm putting it in the center yet. Where does this go? Head? It's the only place it can go, really? So I need to take out the small laser. I can move the small laser. Target computer. Alright, so... It still gives me the same weight. 
the AC-10++ does 60 damage, 50 crit, times 2. And its weight is 12 tons. And this thing's weight is 15 tons. And it does 75. With 100% crit rate bonus. Where's the UAC? So, there it is. Or I can get 255s. Now, is that 28 heat each? Or just 28 heat? It goes up to 450. This goes up to 450. And this goes up to something much higher than that, right? 720. But if I swap it out, I could probably do quite a bit more damage. I'm thinking. Let's... Well, actually, I already did... It. No, I haven't finished my upgrade. This is the only one I'm upgrading, right? So I'm not doing the AC-10. I'm looking at you doing the, the UAC-10 for a possible 110 points of damage. 15 stability... That's 30 stability, 12, yeah. So this is definitely um, total for that. So here we see the 55 times 2, the stability of 15 times 2, which is 30, and the heat of 28, which is 4 more than the double heat of a UAC-10. But that's still less heat than the Goss rifle, right? No. Oh, what a what a choice! A little bit less, but I think this feels like a better weapon to me. Sixty, thirty stability, hundred ten. This reaches long. I should still be able to do pretty good damage with it. Let's do that. And the other thing is, is I can add some more stuff now. Uh, first of all, ammo. I need AC-10 ammo. Do I have any other kind of ammo in here for AC-10? No, just basic ammo. AC-10, drop one, drop two. So I got 48 tons. I could add one more ton of something. I don't have any decent, yeah, I didn't think so. Let us consider that he's still shooting medium range-ish. Uh, let's see. That's one ton for another medium laser. I could put in like another couple of medium lasers here. Like this. Put that over there. Did I drop one down here? I thought I did. There we go. I could do two, or I could just armor up. I didn't increase the heat efficiency that much. So I think we'd armor up. Excellent. Take a tad bat there. Tad here, tad there. Add a, some to the legs. And what, the front? It's over? Oh, here are the odds. There are odd, odd man out ones there. And there. There. Okay. That feels like a much tougher, tankier, juggernaut sniper type. Not really a sniper now. 44 days. Holy crap. Dude, really? Wow. Do I leave it? I could probably go without the hunchback, but 44 days? Damn. Damn. I think what I'll do is I'm going to do... No, no, no. Cancel that. Stop that. I'm going to go ahead and do it. And here's why. I've got a couple of small things here. 
And I think what I'm going to do is, in between this run and the next one, I might do... Uh, these are all travels, huh? Where's this travel to? 40 days to Kintaka. But it includes travel cost, but I'm going to flip over at least once. But I can probably do that. probably do that so what I might do is this half corporate sequence uh, secrets one do that I'll gain a little bit of planetary uh, a reputation from it maybe a little bit but I'm gonna go like max salvage maybe just try to get some stuff out of it and then um, when we come back we'll we'll do the next run for, well we'll do that this one come back and join me we'll do this one next and then I'll head off to the to never never land thanks for joining me take care bye bye Thanks for watching another episode of Dexter Plays. Subscribe to join the pack and leave a like. I'm creeping through the shadows in the corners of your mind. I go with the windows. I run but I don't hide. I hear the call of the wild. Whisper in the name. No, I can't be tamed. My heart belongs to the night. I'm alone, I'm alone, I'm a, I'm a lone wolf. I'm a lone wolf I'm a lone wolf I'm a, I'm a, I'm a lone wolf I'm a, I'm a, I'm a lone wolf I'm a, I'm a, I'm a lone wolf I'm a, I'm a